What's going on, guys? Bus TV Chan. Found something for you guys. Well, I've seen it for a while, but I wasn't able to ever stop. But they are open right now. 2737. I don't know what it's gonna look like in here. I'm just you're seeing it for the first time, just like me. It's got the seats in there. I don't know if it's a flexible or a grooming, but I'm about to find out right now. Man, I've been trying to get I've been trying to get shots of this thing for a while. Let's get a good front shot real quick. We're near Kingman, Arizona. Uh, pretty much near Kingman, Arizona. And off of I-40, there's this thing. It's kind of hard to see from the highway because there's trucks are blocking it, but you can easily, if you're looking for them, you'll find them. So I saw it. And, uh, 2737. It's been a while since I've been in one of these guys, but I had to come over here and show you guys what I saw. I've been trying to get a video of this thing for a long time. I haven't been able to because uh, the gate's always closed. So, well, let's see. It says flexible up there, so hopefully, you guys can see the plate. 89, made in 89. Manufactured in Ohio. We got some sign stuff going on in there. Now the guy don't know much information as far as if it's anything about it. I just said, hey, it's a city of uh, LA bus. He said, I think so, but I mean, I can, I know that much. I know that much because. I just know that much. I mean, I don't know what kind of engine this thing has. I could tell from the road it was a... I think... Well, I think it's a L.A. bus. That's the old L.A. paint scheme, if I'm not mistaken. So... I try to close the doors, but the doors are stiff. This thing has probably been here for, for a very long time. No bees nest that I can see. Everything, I mean, the seats look okay, but they're going to have, I mean, if anybody was to restore this thing, they'd probably get new seats. The floor looks, the floor looks pretty decent. I mean, it's been sitting in the desert, so I'm, you know, I, I'm sure that maybe it's gotten hot in here and things have cracked over time. But, you know, my bus that I have, the new Flyer D35LF, all this stuff is cracking already. I could see one piece down there, up there, coming down. Looks like destination sign is in there i don't i couldn't tell you what kind of destination sign it is i would i, I would say illuminator but I'm, I'm i might be wrong but um yeah that's 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 as much as i can get because we've got some stuff here i don't want to really i don't know what all this other stuff is this looks like fuck uh x-ray equipment or something but but uh yeah man it looks pretty good there's an old advertisement back there, Metro advertisement. If I can get into the back door, I'll try to get a picture of that. There's a little piece of some kind of advertisement there. Something Park, California. So. I guess that's how they do their mirrors in LA so they can see what's going on up there. <laughs> Travel smart, take Metro. Uh, they put the, the not in service sticker on it. That's pretty cool. What does it say underneath there? can't really make it out it's probably the fair or something can't really see what it says kneeling bus kind of advertisement we got Sunday May 4th 8 p.m. three-hour movie Lucy so maybe that'll give you an idea of how old it is Let me see if I can get into the back I wonder if this thing was towed in or... I don't know. Unless I... Unless I... I cannot... I'm a pretty big guy if you guys don't know me. I cannot fit through there. But... I'm gonna take a little peek. I guess we could take a little look here. The windows are all good. 
although the windows are like well this one but the frame looks well i'm not gonna mess with it actually the frame doesn't look that good so i don't want to mess with it too much but uh yeah she looks pretty good i would man if this thing ran that'd be cool it'd be real cool not a metro bus anymore guys are crossing it out 2737 i guess that was a this is kind of from before my time, but maybe that's a garage logo. I mean, I'm not, I'm not like extremely familiar with the LACMTA, so. Uh, another advertisement in the back. I guess they didn't have my, uh, rear destination signs. Well, there's an engine in there. You guys who know much more about the older engines might know what that is, but I couldn't tell you. I mean, looks like everything's there. I'm going to put this down for a second so I don't slam this thing shut because I don't think the air... Alright. What do we got on this side? So I guess it was operated by MTA. Man, guys, you don't understand. I've been trying to... I love flexibles. They're like my favorite units, man. This thing is like... Look at this. The body is in really good shape. Like someone could easily... This would be a really low-cost job, you know? Get another engine or whatever and bust it up. See if I can squeeze through this side. Get some couple pictures. Sorry about the wind, guys, but yeah, I mean, by the tire, air pressure, it's been sitting for a while. So that's cool. I just show you the inside of the, real quick. On this side, I can't really fit on that side, but let's go take a better look at the front again. Uh, a, a really good look at the front because I kind of jumped right into the inside, but. Anyway, guys, near Kingman, Arizona. I have no idea if it's for sale. Um, this is like I, I don't I don't know what this is. This is like a I don't want to say a salvage yard because I don't see a lot of stuff here. But well, I see a lot of stuff, but I don't see like cars and stuff. You know what I mean? Those are my favorite flexible doors anyway. I don't know if they're the best, but yep. It looks like the destination sign is in there, but I'm not I can't tell you off the top of my head what kind of by looking at it I couldn't tell you what kind of uh I couldn't tell you what kind of uh, destination sign it is. I would say illuminator, but who knows? This is a good shot of the front again. As much, that's as much as I can really get as far as images. But um, all the clearance lights are on there, not cracked. I don't know about that headlight. So I guess it wasn't like a extra part bus because it looks it looks good, man. It looks real good. But yeah, that's 2737 over here. Flexible old colors. I don't know if these things were ever in new colors, but wheelchair. I guess I was gonna say I don't know how that stuff works. I'm just messing with stuff. I don't know what kind of transmission that would be. But there's the driver area. Good old flexible. I would like I would I would man the brakes over here, huh? But uh, yeah, not too many of these left on the road, so. But yeah, thanks for tuning in, guys. Appreciate it. I couldn't really see that ad over there, but that's got to be it's a Metro ad. I could tell from here. It says the Metro system announces. Let me see if I can get over there to show you guys.
Oh, uh, this new schedule. I'll get over there and show you. MTA guys. Metro System announces bus schedule and route improvements effective June 3rd, 2001. So wow, these things were running. This is a nice RTS 114, 402, 436, and 444 discontinued, huh? There's a good shot of you. You guys might want to check that out. While I'm back here, what do we got? Hopefully I don't fall to the floor, huh? <laughs> Very nice, man. I like it, guys. Looks like we're... Did they not have the... They only had these? Cool. Well, I don't know what happened there. Remember that sound? I can't do it too well, but... No, I'm just kidding. Alright, yeah, so there you go. There you have it, guys. Let me see if I can get the heck out of here. Yeah, these guys are friendly. They didn't care. I just told them, hey. I asked them a couple questions, and they seem to not really be knowledgeable about it too much, but I don't know what all that stuff is there. But, yeah, thanks for watching, guys. I don't know why it's upside down. Sorry about that. I really hope I wasn't holding it upside down the whole time. But, um, yeah. All right, guys. Hey, look. RTD logo. Hmm. Interesting. All right, take care, guys. Why does it keep doing that? It keeps flipping over. All right, there we go. All right, see you guys.